So, with my A-level students, I have... I got all their email addresses, which <coughs> I didn't have with. And I sent them a link to this Padlet, which had... Sorry. That image. <coughs> and that image alone, and there's no other information. Um, and I've asked them to... That image should be there, look. But it's not today. Yeah. And I asked them to critique it, but also to give their own personal opinion because they weren't discussing work in class, their own or anybody else's, and their skills really needed um, to be practiced, but they didn't want to do it in class. So we did this online and I asked them to do it that night, while well, they remembered, and most of them did, to be fair. Um, it was very interesting to see who responded first and who responded most. Yeah, yeah. It was not who I expected at all. Um, and it's been really easy to use and it's super and I really enjoy it. It's great, I'm going to use it every week. Right, well, I, this is quite a basic Padlet. So the session yesterday was um, a CPD, so Continuing Professional Development session on coaching. And I had seven learners who ranged from, there was a consultant ophthalmologist, there was a physio, there was um, some nurse from mental health, nursing managers who deals with complaints. So there was a real mixture of people from within the health board here. I have about 15 minutes at the end of the session where I got, I sort of passed around the tablets and my laptop and I got them to put some of their feedback on there. So it was, the question was, what, which model do they prefer and leave a note where and when you will lose it, use it in the workplace. Um, entry level students, uh, level three um, with some level one. So this was my, um, this was my personal trial. So I was thinking how could I use this to research one photographer. What I also done was looked at um, various uh, differentiation with the questioning. Can you find a YouTube clip? It was a very simple activity for that some learners to do. Um, I, can you name a fact about your photographer? They were sort of uh, lower order questioning. Um, so for the you know higher order questionings, uh, questions that we could identify, you know, describe what's in the image. You know, well, what is in the image? How many people are in there? What you know, where? What kind of people are in there? Where are they sitting? What What do you think they're doing? So um, we could differentiate between learners. My use of Padlet. Okay, I was teaching a level two bookkeeping and accountancy um, course, and I decided to use Padlet to try and get them to get back into the frame of mind again. We'd, we'd had a break of about six weeks from, for exams and Christmas and what have you, so I thought they'd kind of forgotten what they were being, what they'd been doing. So the first thing we did when we got into the classroom is I set, basically got a small sign onto a computer, put the Padlet up, and at first they weren't sure what was happening. I didn't really explain it to them, I just said, right, read what it says and do what it says, hopefully, and then they all started looking, but then when they actually all turned around and noticed what was actually up on the board in front of, you know, in front of the classroom, they were, they were made up, so oh. it made it really, really fun. But the way I used it was, instead of asking them to explain too much on the Padlet itself, I just wanted them to record keywords. So, these are things that appeared. Um, but what I went round then and asked random people to explain some of the terms and phrases so it wasn't necessarily that they'd put them up themselves. I was trying to then use it to try and get what they you know, for them to try and explain the different phrases that came up. So all I said to them was that all you have to do is double click anywhere and type something in. So that's all they were doing and then they realised um, what, they, what they was actually doing. So it was really good. It was really successful. They found it really fun because I asked them after you know, for feedback, and they said they loved it because they'd never had anything like this before. So